I know you're not speaking to me, but you gotta admit, this train, this night, it's pretty romantic. Haven't you ever had a fantasy like this? About a night like this on a train like this? Yep, only none of these people were in it, including you. I love it when you talk mean to me. So when is this stupid murder supposed to happen, anyway? Now, I've heard that scream before. Oh. Oh. I think he's dead. You don't want to sleep here tonight. Perhaps it was something he ate. Maybe it's part of the mystery. Maybe he's just faking. Don't touch that man. You don't know where he's been. Pretty dead. This has got to be some incredible, amazing, sick joke. Talk about life imitating art. Art? Don't make me laugh. What we've got here is life imitating trash. You want to bet this guy catches flies with his tongue? How about a little respect for the dead? I respect you, Rodney. I don't believe you people. JB is lying here dead, and you're trading quips. What would you like us to do, Janet? Well, for one thing, we could stop this train. No, not possible. It can't be done. I remember in 77 when I was passing that kidney stone. Sebastian, was... please spare us. What are we going to do? JB is dead. And it would seem one of us killed him. I have an idea. For 15 years. We've been gathering together to solve a mystery, a mystery served up by JB. This train is not stopping for another 22 hours, folks. Hmm. I like it, I like it. Are you suggesting we turn JB's death into a game? Somebody's already done that, lady. I agree with Sebastian. We owe it to JB to solve this murder among ourselves. Besides, which would we rather hand over to the police? A dead body or a live murderer? This is sick and stupid. Aren't we giving the murderer a break here? I mean, how are we possibly going to be able to find the murderer if he or she is free to tamper with the evidence or change the clues? She's right. You're all mystery experts. Whoever did it is going to have a dandy time watching the rest of you race down blind alleys. What you're saying is that we need someone to lead the investigation, someone without a connection to J.B. Someone without a motive. Someone without luggage. David, I just don't think... That's okay. You look good. So, gang, what we have to do is figure out where to start. What we have here is a dead body. Amazing observation. Apparently without a murder weapon. Wouldn't the killer have taken the weapon and thrown it off the train? Good question, Agnes. No talking, Rodney. David. Oh, gee, already? Is there a freezer on this train? No, no, it's not that. It's... Magic knife. He's covered with it. Covered with it? How do you suppose he came to have your perfume all over him, Janet? How do you think? The mind reels. Sell it somewhere else, Miss McCall. The prom ended for you and JB years ago. What are you saying? That I killed him? I wonder if she didn't hide the murder weapon in her room. In her room. In my room? In your room. Let me add it. It's got to be somewhere in the room. Leave no stone unturned. Why is What are you people doing? Oh, partner, why don't you and I search down here a minute? Certainly. Addison, this isn't an investigation. It's an inquisition. Say that in English. Left to their own devices, these people are going to kill each other. So? So? Don't you have any feeling of responsibility for these people? I don't even want to be on this dumb train, and I have a feeling of responsibility for these people. We can't let them just run around willy-nilly making accusations. What? One of us has to take charge and keep these people occupied until this dumb train stops. Why? Why? For goodness sakes, if you don't care about anyone else on this train, don't you care about DePesto? What about her? She's an innocent. Didn't you notice whose bed the killer left the body in? She could get hurt in the middle of this. Accusations, innuendos. Addison, I know you. You would never forgive yourself if something happened to her. Never? Never was a long time, Eddie. Hmm. 
Just how cold and unfeeling do you think I am? Don't answer that. It's an essay question. Think about it for a minute. Now, let's go back down here to episode 88 of Dynasty and see if things have calmed down a little bit. What are you doing? It doesn't make sense. Everybody knows that I love J.B.